and this is John again. Uh, guys, when I do my videos, uh, I look for other videos to put either partial videos of their videos or, or, or whole videos of other videos to make part of my video and use others uh, to uh, videos I find that's good to be part of my video. And I have to look at them really good because their Bibles are being changed during the time of the Great Deception. The Bible changes are a big part of the Great Deception. And I have to, if they're using Bible verses and talking about Bible verses or, or showing Bible verses and they've been changed, I tend to not use those uh, videos, even though this was a, good, a great video I was going to put in it until I got to the part in it called uh, Jesus, a holy thing, uh, like in this verse says, it, it was quoting this verse, and the guy was talking about this verse, about the angel talking to Mary, and uh, I'll read it to you, but it calls Jesus a holy thing, and Jesus is definitely not a holy thing. And it's, uh, we're in the time of the falling away, the great apostasy. Most people are falling away from the truth because they don't know the Bibles have been changed. Most people are deceived. It says God will send them a strong delusion. Those that... Uh, that didn't didn't receive the love of the truth that they might believe a lie that thou might be down to believe not the truth but have pleasure in the righteousness something like that uh, read the verses i can't remember what verses those are but look them up and uh he said send them, god would send them a strong delusion and a lot of people have been sent a strong delusion because they don't see the bible changes and then they get mad when you tell them about the bible changes god separating the barley from the wheat from the tares because we're supposed to know our true lord and our uh, he's we're supposed to know our true shepherd's voice, it says in the Bible, and we, we ain't supposed to follow a strange shepherd's voice. And most people are following a strange shepherd's voice, and they don't see the Bible changes, and they're sitting in church listening to a lot of false preaching. And a lot of preachers are false, false preaching, a lot of false, a lot of false preaching. Uh, but doctrines has been put in the Bible now by uh, demons. It says they'll be listening in the last days to doctrines of devils, of demons, which a lot of people are. And it said they'll be looking for the word of God and be travel north, south, east, west, and they can't find it. Uh, there'll be a famine in the land, but not a famine, not a famine for, for a hunger for food or a thirst for water, but a famine for the word of God, something like that. Now, I'm not quoting that verse. Uh, look it up. I wish I had those verses on hand, but you can look them up to get what they say. But those have been changed. Some of that verses uh, have been changed, too. Uh I ain't going to get into all that. I'm, right here's what I'm going to show you, the changes of it. Uh, like I said, God separating the barley from the wheat from the tares. Uh, Luke 1.35, and the people should, people should know this is a change to the Bible. Anybody should know this is a change. If you have the Holy Spirit, it leads you to all truth. And the angel, I was told, God told me to keep spreading the word, and he told me in a strange way to keep spreading the word about the Bible changes. He put it in my reminders in my in an app, and I never even used the app the reminders app. I never once have even put anything in the reminders, and it came up in my reminders said keep telling people about the Bible. So I took that as God telling me, Jesus telling me to keep telling people about the Bible change, and so I figured I better do that. I don't want God. I don't want God Yahweh or Jesus mad at me. And this is Luke 135 King James Version. You know, it's, this, it's the King James Version. They changed it, seemed to the most, but they changed all versions of the Bible. And I even was told that there's not even a Greek word for the word thing. Uh, whether that's true or not, I don't know. But it's supposed to be the Holy One or Holy Child. But here's what they put, put as the Bible says in King James Version now. And Luke 135, And the angel answered and said unto her, the Holy Ghost shall come upon thee, and the power of the highest shall overshadow thee. Therefore also that holy thing which shall be born of thee shall be called the Son of God. Jesus ain't a holy thing. He is the Holy One. It's supposed to say the Holy One or, or the Holy Child. I think the Holy One. And to call Jesus a holy thing, that's horrible. I wouldn't think that. I'm, I'm like 99.99% that's been changed. I'm, I'm, I'm not 99.99% sure that's been changed because I remember it as the Holy One or Holy Child. And uh, here, the Lord's Prayer, Matthew 6, 9 through 13. 
After this manner, therefore, pray ye, our Father, which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done in earth. In earth. Supposed to be, oh, right there. In, in, supposed to be on earth as it is in heaven. Not, not in earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. We're supposed to be and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen. Guys, uh, I want to make this short little video to tell you uh, our Bibles are being changed. And we're in the time of the Great Deception. It's been going on for probably close to three years or so, or maybe even a little longer, or maybe about that long. The Bible changes, and that's just part of that's a big part of the Great Deception. I feel like the Lord wants me to tell this, so uh, people may not enjoy this video as much as some of the other ones. Uh, I don't care. I feel like I need to do this. That's what the Lord wants me to tell you, and I'm going, I'm going to do what the Lord leads me to do. There's many, many, many other verses and Bible changes I could show you, but I want to show you these because these are pretty obvious changes to me. All right, guys. Love you all. God bless you. I'll talk to you. See you on the next video.